The box is empty. Or should I say, incomplete. Where is the rest of it? We know who you are. We know who you were. You've come far for someone who was merely once a concubine. I will ask you again, assassin. What is this box? Where did it come from, and what is its purpose? Why continue to resist us? Look around you. No one is coming. We wiped out your order. There is no escape from here. Why would I want to escape? I am exactly where I want to be. Such arrogance! Ma Yong Cheng will make you talk. Let him try. No wonder your kind fell so far. My kind isn't done yet. Where is the box you took from me? Far from your reach by now, assassin. One of your tiger brothers must have it. No matter. I will find which one and retrieve it from his still warm corpse. Do you even know what the box is? I know it belongs to the Brotherhood. How naive. Thinking you can retrieve the box thinking that killing me will achieve anything. Killing just one of you will not give me the vengeance I seek. You are the first of the tigers to fall, but you will not be the last. This was once a safe place for us assassins. Sung Yong's tigers saw to the end of that. Their forces surprised and overwhelmed us. All but wiping out the Brotherhood. Gao Feng's death will send a message to the Templars. The Assassins have returned. Is it done? Gao Feng is dead, Sifu. As is Ma Yong Cheng. The Butcher? Good. Our plan worked. Who's next? Patience, sister. We must move carefully. Zhang Yong and his tigers control the Empire now. He is down two tigers after tonight. Gao Feng did not have the box. I did not retrieve it in time. Worry not, young one. We knew that was a risk. To allow yourself to be captured without the box would have meant certain death. We will get it back. Maybe the Templars will even lead us to the missing piece. Perhaps. But now I'm afraid we have just given our enemies a dangerous weapon. Take some rest, little sister. Together, we will free our land from the Templars and their pawns. Zhang Yong and his tigers. We will rebuild our brotherhood. Macau. By day, a bustling port. By night, a hub for the Templars to trade those who oppose them into slavery. I have located the box, Xiao Jun. It's in the possession of Yu Deyong, another of Zhang Yong's tigers, the one they call the Slaver. So he is responsible for this cruelty. I shall pay him a visit. Tread lightly, sister. The Templars are searching all ships and cargo. They are looking for us now. I know you can kill these lesser men with ease, but I would suggest you remain invisible, a ghost, until you find your target. I am the blade in the shadows. My prey is Yu Dae Yong. I shall walk into darkness and strike swiftly. No one will stop me in my hunt. This belongs to me. Zhang Yong will come for the box. He will avenge our deaths. I am counting on it. His body is still warm. The assassin cannot be far. Shall we search the docks, Master Chu Ju? The assassins claim they protect the innocents. Let us show them that their actions have consequences. 
Arrest everyone. Burn all the ships to ashes and find me the assassin. What happened in Macau was not your fault, little sister. This tiger, Xiu Zhu, burned the port. He's known for his cruel deeds. We call him the demon. I know, Sifu, but we caused this madness. My desire for revenge did. I already warned you about those feelings, Xiao Jun. I know your quest for vengeance fits with the goals of the Brotherhood, but you cannot put your heart into such endeavors. Master Ezio told me the same thing. A wise man, to be sure. Unlike our next target, Wei Bin. The snake. The one who led the slaughter of our brotherhood, Sang Yong's right hand man. Yes. So, Wei Bin should lead us to him. But the danger is greater than ever. They know what we can do now, and they want this box and the secrets it may hold. You will travel to Wei Bin alone. I know of someone here in Na'an who may be able to help us use the box. Very well, Sifu. I will find you once Wei Bin is dead, and I have Zhang Yong's location. I am the blade in the shadows. My prey is Wei Bin. I shall walk in the darkness and strike swiftly. No one will stop me in my hunt. Then I will kill your master. Where is Zhang Yong? <laughs> Closer than you would care to imagine. <coughs> he is here. In Nyan. You think you're so smart that you could play us? We know about Wang Yang Ming. As you hunted me, Zhang Yong hunts him. Soon, you will truly be the last of your kind. If Zhang Yong is here in Na'an, then I must find him, before he finds Wang Yangming. <gasps> here she is, finally. Sea girl, I have your precious box. Kill her! Sifu, I'm sorry. I was too slow. I should have reached you sooner. I could have stopped Zhang Yong. I could have protected the box. What good is it to take revenge if I keep losing those I care for? I could have saved you. I was born into captivity, one of many concubines. When the Brotherhood came for us, I saw freedom. I saw a future. Now it is up to me to offer hope for those who see none. When Zhang Yong and Chu Ju are dead, when I have the box, I will deliver that. Now my journey has come full circle. My past has returned to aid my future. My old friend, once a concubine like me, is now Empress, and she's risking her life to help me. She knows where to find Sang Yong, but I fear she and the concubines are in grave danger. If the Templars suspect they are helping me, they will kill them in the blink of an eye. Your Highness, it is good to see you again. What is wrong? I'm sorry. We meet again, Xiao Jun. I recognized you in Na'an. I remembered that you were once a concubine, along with the Empress. She was more than willing to lure you here. Please! 
I had no choice. She chose to live. Her life meant more to her than yours. Who would blame her? I forgive you, sister. Your forgiveness is touching, but useless. There will be no rebirth of the Assassin's Brotherhood. You have no friends left. The last person alive who you thought you could trust betrayed you. That is how we wiped out your kind. So trusting of others, so weak and pathetic. The same qualities your master showed just before I killed him. Come closer, and I'll show you how weak and pathetic I am. Master, allow me. I am the blade in the shadows. My prey is Sung Yong. I shall walk in the darkness and strike swiftly. No one will stop me in my hunt. All your tigers are dead. Only you remain. I'll take back what you stole from us. My box and my land. Now you plan to let Altan Khan and his Mongolians through the Great War. Madness. You'd let those barbarians invade our home, rather than lose your grip on power. They will not breach the wall. They will not reach China. I will stop them, and then I am coming for you. Your actions here have only delayed the inevitable. Slowing these savages will have only angered them. They will see this as a betrayal, and launch a full-scale assault. They will not reach my land. The wall will hold them back. Your land? You think your successes matter? China is just a piece of the prize. We will rule the world. And the box you so kindly presented us will be yet another tool to achieve a time of peace. Peace? You think you're a hero now? I don't want your world. Your control? Give me the box, and your death will be fast. Your box is lost, assassin. Already out of China, in the safe hands of my fellow Templars. Then another assassin will find the box. That will be their destiny. Mine lies here with you. How does it feel, assassin? Is it as you'd hoped? Do not flatter yourself, Sang Yong. You had to die for China to have hope again. I started this journey for vengeance. But I've understood now that it's pointless. I have found a better goal to pursue. And what is that? The future. A new tomorrow for China and its people. I will undo all that you have done. I will rebuild the Brotherhood and recruit those who wish to make our land a place of freedom. Those ready to die to fight men like you. Your Templar world will not happen. The Assassins will rise again.